But those deaths cost me the PB. Can you believe it? I'm so mad. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna give this one more go. Uh... Yeah, there are skulls. Why does Dodo's lair have skulls in it? What is Dodo doing? It's not Deadly Dodo, it's Donut Dodo. Murders? Listen. This is not true crime, Dodo. This is... This is definitely Donut Dodo. Stinky's victims, all the people who got flushed? All the people who got swirlied a little too long. The Donut Dodo lore is definitely going places already today. I learn new things every time I play. Hey the Brain Mouse, hope you are enjoying your stay here on the stream. I hope you have it a great one. We're gonna be playing some more Donut Dodo for a bit, and then we'll be switching over to viewer matches, I think. I've already got a few people queued up, so might as well knock them out. Not literally, figuratively. Unless you were playing Toy Fighter, then somebody's getting knocked out, I think. Collecting evidence? We're playing on easy medium. What people are awesome, Liz. Tell me all about it. Yeah, that's true. Um, if you if you join somebody on a raid, one of mine, um, or somebody else's, please say hello to the person that we raid after this show. Uh, it really it really makes a lot of people stay. To say hello to new people. Yeah, the Ferris wheel really is the bane of my existence, and I'm gonna miss this fruit, I bet. Huh, never mind, I got it. The stage is super frustrating. Also, hey, Sinistar, what's up? Actually, Sinistar, you're ahead of me on the easy medium leaderboard, aren't you? I'm literally back on the grind. Not, not like super hard, but like a little bit. Hey, Amelia. How you doing? What's with the broken heart? Is there a link to the Discord? You can type in exclamation point salt to join the Salt Road Discord, where we play video games like this and other ones in a marathon format. Uh, this coming Thursday, we are playing... Um, we're playing Caravan. We're going to be playing six games for five minutes. Baker Billy Burns. Oh, there's an arcade version for Actraiser, the new one? Oh, I had no idea. Oh, I gotta play that. I knew that there was scoring in the SNES version, but I didn't really understand it, or like, why I should care. But if there's an arcade mode for the PC version, I'm suddenly way more interested. Yeah, the music's so good, Yell Nenu.
Ah, he thought I could get me, but... <laughs> oh, it's a weird SNES arcade port? Oh. I guess I'm gonna have to go look that up now. That's bizarre. But also very cool. Oh, actually, I'm gonna... I'm gonna go the long way, I think. It's a little more stable. Shit, shit. Get away from me. I may need to focus through this level, just because it's a little complicated. Oh, what is Stinky doing? You should have gone up that ladder, my guy. What? Mm, I was looking at... I was looking at Sniffy. Damn. Yeah, I gotta look this up now. I definitely want to play that. Uh, I'm a big fan of, like, hack and slash games like Rustan. Uh, I played a bit of Volgar back at, you know, not too long ago. I don't want to say back in the day, it's only been s six years. I still low-key mourn, uh, Actraiser 2, because Actraiser 2 is just, like, hmm. Like, they added all of the cool stuff that I wanted in, into Actraiser, but then they made the levels basically impossible, and the enemies have, like, way too much health. And basically... Half of the boss fights are like, do you understand the gimmick, the magic gimmick that we are going for in this boss fight? And if you do, then the fight's really easy, and if you don't, the boss kills you. <gasps> no! Oh, staling this batch basically kills this run, I'm pretty sure. No, the mechanics in Actraiser 2 are perfect. No... I love how diving slashes have invul. Like, that's- that's fantastic. I think more video- okay. I realize that I'm, like, a fighting game person, but I really- I genuinely think that giving players invulnerable tools is a great way to manage the difficulty of encounters. The mechanics are so cool in Actraiser 2, and the game is so such a pain in the butt to play. <sighs> yes, that is true, if I remember correctly. You have to, like, you have to dive a certain amount of time. You should probably be invulnerable from frame one. It should be the other way around, or you're... It, that fruit spawned so fast. That is uncool. Ah. 
There we go. Would it be stupid to take a train just to go get a five bu Okay, if you live in a major city... If you live in a major city where you can go get on a train to go get a burger, that's just transit. That's like saying, is it stupid to get into a car to go get a burger? Of course not. That's just suburbia. If you live in a major metro area with a train system or a subway system, traveling somewhere by train to get food is... us living. That's just an errand. It's definitely more stupid to pay for delivery. Oh my god, Amelia. Just go get dinner. That is true. I think getting... Getting food delivery... Food... Most delivery burgers I've had have been pretty... Pretty mid, at best. I love riding public transit. Uh, I live... I don't even own a car. I, uh... I've renounced car ownership. It's over. I hate him. I hate cars. I hate the streets that provide access to cars. I hate the highway. You're hungry for discourse? I love not needing a car. It's so good. Yeah, we... Don't get me wrong, like, I've definitely commuted by car many times. Um... And if you're a car person, like, more power to you, but... It just ain't for me. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. And we're out. Sixteen hours on a train? No thank you. I also like myself. What were you doing that you needed to be- I missed part of the discussion. Why one would need to be on a train for 16 hours. Should have a fruit soon, right? There it is. Thank you. There he goes. Okie dokie. Hey, let's go. Big PB. Big PB for me. <laughs> GG gamers. Uh, Three hundred and fifty-five.